Hey guys, so today we're doing um, an advent calendar, which is obviously a beauty advent calendar. This is a makeup stuff channel. So it's beauty, but I had to get it on eBay because I didn't buy it in time for it to, you know, be off the official website. So I had to buy it off a reseller for more money. How nice is that? <laughs> it's great. It's the Cult Beauty one. Cult Beauty is, I believe, a UK retailer. They sell a bunch of brands that are usually sold in America or places that the UK doesn't get access to aka because we don't have a sephora so anything that will be sold in sephora is usually on there huda beauty that kind of stuff it's huge and it's heavy okay so i'm expecting great things because the last advent calendar i opened um today not that great it was a bit disappointing it was very disappointing so i'm expecting great things from this one it was very expensive um i'll put prices of everything on the screen because i can't remember off the top of my head so i'll just put everything on the screen let's start opening i think this is a 24 yes it's 24 the last one i opened was not 24 that was very disappointing i'm just being passive aggressive towards a different advent calendar it's the charlotte tilbury one it just hurt my feelings anyway this comes in these squares which i like i like the little shelf vibe i think it's nice let's just start opening it's getting hot in here should i put my hair up I feel like that requires a little bit of a hair up situation. So, number one. I like that this one is numbered as well. The Charlotte Tilbury one wasn't numbered. It was just like, open the shelves however you want to open them. Yeah, because there's no important thing. Oh, this is big. We're already getting big sizes of things. Do you see this glass? Big. Probably not a travel size. Oh, I just love to see it. I love to see it. Because with the Charlotte Tilbury one, three products were full size. The rest were travel size. And it was... Very expensive. Okay, so this one, Jordan Samuel Skin Hydrate the Mist. You can use it AM and PM just to mist thoroughly after cleansing, just so you can hydrate, and then you can use it throughout the day as well. I'm very excited about this. This is giving me um, Glow Recipe Watermelon Dewy Mist vibes. I love it. I'm so excited already. This is great. I knew Cult Beauty was not going to disappoint me because I just love Cult Beauty. Two, we get another full size. Brio Geo Sculpt Revival Charcoal and Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. Amazing. We love it. No one wants, you know, dry scalp. Not very comfortable feeling. Amazing. I love Brio Geo. I, can't, I have nothing bad to say right now. I'm already excited. Let's just get into it. And 25 is in red, which makes me think that there's actually going to be a big 25 present because with Charlotte Tilbury, I was expecting a big palette in there and it just wasn't available. So let's just keep it moving. Number three is quite small. Victoria Beckham lipstick, full size. Guys, this is already just making me so happy. Okay. I'm just so happy. I haven't tried anything from Victoria Beckham. This is weighted. It's very luxe. It's got like a luxe look to it. Let's open it. Very nice shade. Nice and pink, nice and wearable. Let me just unscrew it and try it on my hand. Oh, it's like a balm. Oh, that's beautiful. I'm so excited. Anything I don't like is going into the giveaway pile or anything that I already have, which is something that I'm trying to do more often now is if I get stuff and I don't want it, instead of just having it lay around my house, I can give it away to you guys because um, it will just help me as well. Honestly, selfish reasons. I just have too much stuff, so I need to get rid of it. So I won't be like swatching anything that i don't want just so it's not touched i hope i want everything though selfishly like because i spent money on it i would hope that i like everything oh my god glow recipe ah anyway watermelon pha plus bha pore type toner i already have this one in, in the big size this is the smaller size i don't even mind this is the smaller size because it's still a really good product and it's a good size okay look at this oh i love it oh, i'm so happy about it honestly why couldn't the Charlotte Tilbury one be like this? Because I looked dead behind the eyes when I was filming that video. I was like, really? I'm getting a travel size again? Wow. Thank you, Charlotte Tilbury. And I love Charlotte Tilbury. I'm being so passive aggressive because I love Charlotte Tilbury. It's my favorite brand. 90, no, 75% of my face makeup every day is Charlotte Tilbury. So to get a really disappointing advent calendar was a bit like, you know, number five. Oh, another favorite product. I'm so excited. The Pharmacy Green Clean Cleansing Balm, which is the best cleansing makeup balm, <laughs> makeup cleansing balm I've ever used. Um, honestly, this one melts like nothing in the world. Like I've tried so many cleansing balms. I've tried Drunk Elephant. I've tried Glow Recipe. I've tried a few brands and the Pharmacy one is the best. And I keep on stocking up on it because I just can't live without it. It's the best. Comes with a little spatula. 
let me take it out this packaging so i can save some space i'll just take it out the packaging so number five is truly iconic i just one of my favorite brands for makeup cleansing pharmacy just in general makes really good skincare love it five six what is it let me know oh oh it's a it's called tinted and it is something in the shade dawn it's a face body visage corpse i, be I believe it's probably like a highlight situation let me see it yeah let me open it okay oh oh it's maybe it's like a mixing medium like so you can like make stuff a little bit more dewy oh yeah it's kind of like a oh very nice uh oh i put a bit too much okay so it's like a dewy situation um in a squeezy bottle this will last you forever look at that that looks wet does it have a dry down situation or is it just oily anyway i'm trying to spread it out as much as possible look at that glow though you could definitely put this under your makeup like under your foundation as like a little bit of a dewy situation or you can just put it on your self as a little bit of a dewy situation it's more dew than it is shimmer but it's like a little bit of a combo situation very nice um let me just put that aside six now we're on to seven shiseido very expensive brand uh, vital perfection uplifting and firming cream it's a 15 mil which is quite small but it's okay because everything else is so amazing that i'm like Ugh, i'll live with one of these vital perfection uplifting and firming cream i'm happy to be uplifted and firmed <laughs> uh this is great guys i'm so excited seven where's eight eight up at the top oh my god i'm just trying to get it out okay oh augustinus beta the face oil it's a face oil i don't have a face oil so i'm just gonna take this one because i've used up all of my face oils and i like to add it into like moisturizer if my skin's super dry um or just add it kind of wherever i have dry patches so i might actually I'm grateful for this. This is great. I just, wow, and it's a glass bottle. Very nice. So far, there are no duds. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Eight. Where's nine? Swede Pro Lash Lift Mascara. It's a full size mascara. You see this Charlotte Tilbury? It's a full size. The other one was Charlotte Tilbury gave 12 compartments, and one of them was a travel size mascara. Not even a travel, like a sample. Yeah, this one's full size. Swede. Pro Lash Lift. I'm not going to open it so I don't get any oxygen in there because then it dries out. But I love a good mascara. Ten. There we go. That's a good one. Oh, why are there two products in one? Oh, no, this one's for this one. Okay, I don't know which one was which. So ten and four kind of got mixed up. So one of these is ten one of these is four. So why haven't I opened four yet? Or was there two in one? Right. Because if that was... Wait... How, am I, how many am I supposed to be on 10? Okay, so I think we missed number four, which is fine. Um, we have the, this is one of my favorites, Supergoop Glow Screen 38, 30 SPF, just face cream. And it's actually hydrating, kind of like a primer. It's got like a dimethicone feel to it, which is really good under makeup because some SPFs under makeup just don't do what they need to be doing. So I love this. I keep it in my primer drawer. I already have one of these, but I use them a lot for the summertime i don't think you can ever have enough spf in your house and then um this one is a full this is um how many 30 vegan soft gels um it's d3 but without the uv damage so it's kind of funny that you know you get the spf but also the vitamin d very nice i'm happy to eat my vitamins you know 10 where is 11 11 some kind of a pipette situation um odyssey Okay. pure elements wild carrot serum concentrate vital glow mix two to three drops in your cream or apply alone for a more intensive solution very interesting i love a good serum i'm just so excited that we're finally getting some good products 11 12 where's 12 up here let's open that up oh sunday riley that's a good brand that's a really good brand and it looks like a decent size there's confetti everywhere this is the autocorrect brightening and depuffing eye contour cream. It's huge for an eye cream. 
Wow. I know it comes with one of these. Sunday Riley, good brand. Quite expensive. 13 is another big one. And we get Summer Fridays. I've gotten samples of this before. Oil-free gel cream. Um, I'm so excited about this one because I've seen it. And I was, ugh, I just thought it looked so cute. This whole brand looks adorable. Comes with a little spatula. I love receiving these free spatulas because they just always get lost and I like not dipping my fingers into things. Anyway, very nice packaging. Let's just open it quickly just to see what's going on inside. Oh yeah, I've received a sample of this before, but I've never got to really like try it properly. So I'm excited about this face cream. Guys, I'm getting so much nice stuff. Uh, 14. We have Oskia London um, Hydra Serum. Shake before use, apply after cleansing, morning and evening, or when skin is in need of extra hydration and comfort. Ideal post treatment. Glass, amazing. I love a hydrating serum. Um, like I said, my skin is dry this winter time. Everywhere. I'm just crusty and dry. Just crusty, dusty, musty. I need all the hydration I can get. 14, where's 15? I'm so excited. Oh, Briogeo we love to see it another one of these don't despair repair deep conditioning mask i love don't despair repair i love the whole line it's amazing there's 16. the ordinary a little bit more affordable but still a full size love to see it niacinamide plus zinc 10 percent niacinamide one percent zinc i've been running out of my niacinamide serum i have some glow recipe ones now but i'm going on a no buy in the new year so the more i can stock up on the better because then the less urge to buy things very excited about this um and i had great things about that one as well it's really potent and stuff so really excited about it 16 17 oh this looks like a good size molten brown very expensive and it's a jasmine and sun rose bath and shower gel it's a good size oh smells fresh smells nice smells expensive can't wait to put it in my shower. 18. <sighs> Ooh. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Okay, so I just pulled out one of these drawers. And it's not even one product. It's just like a bunch of minis of things. Oh my god. Is that supposed to be there? I know I got this on eBay, but it was closed. So I, I don't think they just gave me free stuff. Anyway, there's an It Cosmetics Kabuki brush. Always need new brushes because I wash them all the time. So I'm trying to be very um, diligent with my brush cleansing because that gives you spots and it just, you know, it's not good for your skin. So I like to wash them as much as possible. Oh my God, this one's so cute. It's so good for foundation and it's a mini. So you can take it traveling with you. Um, then we have Fresh. Sugar Strawberry Exfoliating Face Wash Gently Refines and Softens. And this looks like a full size. Like this looks like quite a big, it's, it's 50 mil, not 30, 50. Amazing. I've heard great things about Fresh. They're very expensive. Dr. Barbara Sturm, very expensive. We know that much. Um, that's, these are glow drops. Okay, so you can look nice and dewy. Makes sense. That's all I read from the back. It's just so you can look a bit more dewy. Amazing. I, if I look more dewy, I'll be very happy. Glow drops made in Germany. I'm happy to use these. Then we have Natasha Denona Micro Macro Blade Liquid Liner. Macro Blade, not Micro Blade. I'm not going to open it because I don't want to dry it out. Um, but I've been getting back into doing liquid liner. And this is like a very nice packaging. See, I'm just doing liquid liner again. And I just love the way it makes my makeup look. So I'm actually very excited about this. Because I got rid of a lot of um, liquid liners because they just weren't it. They were either just grey or bleeding everywhere. Then I have a small, better than sex mascara. See, this is what happens when you give me minis, but you put all the minis into one section, I'm not going to be upset about it. But if you give me 12 doors, and each of them is a travel size, I'm going to be quite pissed off. Like, I don't mind getting minis as long as I'm getting more than one mini in each container, right? Like, don't give me one mini per container. Tiny better than sex mascara. I love it. I'm seeing family over Christmas, so... If I can take some minis with me instead of full sizes, then I can save some space in my luggage. NARS Bronzing Powder. Amazing. It's in the shade Laguna, which is obviously their bestseller. It's this like tiny one. If I really like it, I might actually end up traveling with a lot of these minis because why would I need to take full sizes of anything? Look at it. It's so cute. Uh, oh my God, I love it. And it's like a really good shade for me. 
love it can i swatch oh that feels amazing i was never like there for the hype of nars laguna so i'll get to try it now ipod to back what does that mean oh oh uh, this is cute okay so it's one of these like metal and you unscrew it and inside is an eyeshadow right that's an eyeshadow yeah except i've got long nails and i can't reach in there so i'll have to use a brush um because i can like barely touch it but it's it's just one of those like let me try and get some more on my finger that would be helpful it's one of these like super natural glowy eyeshadows that you can just use for like a one eyeshadow look which i think is always very cute you can take like a fluffy brush in there because it's more satin than anything swing it through the crease put it on the lid do some mascara and you're good to go and then we have a small laura mercier loose setting powder i used to use this all the time then we have vive which is i believe she's an influencer she started her own brand it's a lip dew glossy lip oil very excited i've never tried anything from vive everyone's been raving about the stuff i'm just excited to be here you know I'm just excited to be here um wow that's cute it's just like a white pearly glittery lip oil very cute let me open it oh big doe foot it's kind of like the dior lip oils you can't see it because it's clear what did i expect do you know what i mean what did i expect let me try and show it to you guys again right there you see that amazing i can't wait to use all of these so that's it for the minis that was an exciting draw see this is how you get me excited about minis is you put more than one in and then i don't notice that it's like you know a mini because i'm like oh my god i'm so excited about all the products but if you just give me one mini and you expect me to be excited no it's not happening oh okay this is cute this is cute 19 okay so it's by rowan it's an eyeshadow palette but i'm just wondering if i already have this one so let me just open it and then i'll find out because if i do then someone's getting it for free but if i don't I'm keeping it because Rowan is my favorite. I already have this one, so I'll actually put this one in a giveaway. I've opened it, but I haven't swatched it, which is important. It is just a very cute eyeshadow. It's got all creams, but three of them are like glittery chunky and one of them is um, more smooth. I love these eyeshadow palettes. You guys know this. These quads have stolen my heart. They make me very happy. So I'll be putting this one into the giveaway pile that I'll do probably after the new year, just collect everything and then just do one giveaway. So this is going in the giveaway pile because I already have this one, but I'm still excited. Like these are like 40 pound quads. Very nice. Ooh, the Inky List, very good brand. Tranexem, Tranexamic Acid Night Treatment helps reduce hyperpigmentation. We love it. Oh my God, there's so much stuff. I love it. 21 is a... Oh, okay, so they gave full sizes of these, like the big size of these in a gift bag that they were doing. Um, and I love this cleanser, so I will snag that up. I love these cleansers. Um, this is Youth to the People Superfood Cleanser. It's green tea, spinach, vitamins, and kale. I love this cleanser so much. It's so good. Oh my God, and this is such a good size. Like it doesn't have to be a jumbo size for me to be happy with it, but make it a little bit more than like a deluxe sample 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 then in number 22 we have alginist genius collagen calming relief apply to clean skin every morning and evening as needed to help soothe and hydrate the skin avoid getting into eyes collagen we need that apparently in our skin to make it not age us quickly 23 is charlotte tilbury hello charlotte i've just been trying to about you eyes to mesmerize oh long lasting eye color in the shade amber gold i don't have that one um i have some of these pots but not all of them oh this is one of the like liquid ones that's such a cute shade it's like a very neutral bronze that you could definitely wear every day look at that oh that's so pretty oh my god look at it it's such a nice shade it's like the perfect neutral in between just goes with every look. I'm excited about this. Why is it that I'm ex more excited about Charlotte Tilbury in the Colt Beauty box than I was about Charlotte Tilbury in the Charlotte Tilbury box? 24, let me just wipe this on my hand. It's getting messy here, okay. It's a good thing that I'm on my last one. Um, well, no, last two, because this one has 25, which is great. So 24, oh, once again, look at this. Oh, I'm so excited about this. 
Kate Somerville Exfoli Kate Intensive Exfoliating Treatment, Hollywood's Two Minute Facial. So it's kind of like Baby Skin by John Elephant or that H A B H A P H A peel by Charlotte Tilbury, uh, where you do a mask and then it it's like exfoliating your skin. Can't wait to use that. Then we have Espa. Feels very expensive. The Grounding Crystals. Sprinkle crystals into a warm bath and swirl through the water, watching them watching watching them dissolve. Why can't I speak today? Uh, smells like lavender and some kind of florals. There's like petals in there, like dried up petals. It kind of smells a bit floral, a bit peppery, a bit old lady, but that's fine. This isn't my favorite scent. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. So I'm actually going to put this in the giveaway. I'm sure someone will enjoy crystals in their bath. So that's going into the giveaway. Then we have C Tetra Lux Lipid Vitamin C. After cleansing in the morning, massage six drops into the face. I love vitamin C. I don't have many. I have one last one and then I'm done with vitamin Cs. So this is coming into my collection. And then we have bubbly eye gels. Love it. It's always good to have those. And then we have, oh, one of my favorite products, TLC Frambuise Glycolic Night Serum. I always have this. It's the most expensive product from Drunk Elephant, but it's probably the most effective one. I love it. I always buy the big size. I just splurge and then I use it for the whole year. So I'm excited to bring this with me when I'm traveling because it's a smaller one. And if I lose it, I won't be upset about it. And then we have number 25, which is the big red box. I'm expecting great things, okay? Um, because they've not disappointed me this advent calendar. Oh, got some kind of a big situ. Oh, it's a candle. Oh my God. What's this by? It's called Loving. It smells really fresh. It's a cute candle. I was expecting maybe something a little bit, this was a bit anticlimactic to give me a candle. I was expecting maybe like an eyeshadow palette or something. I don't know. This is nice though, because with everything else, this is forgivable. If they gave me like really bad products and then a candle, I'd be pretty upset about it, but mm, it smells a bit soapy. Like soap? Lush. It smells like lush. Anyway, keeping that one. Oh my god, the amount of products we have in here. There's definitely a lot of value um in this box. Do I say like, oh, you have to get these to get all the like, you know, do I think this is like necessary? No, but is it fun to open? Yes. And was this one not disappointing? Yes, but I just think, look, if you open this every day for 25 days, you would not be upset. Is it a lot of money? Yes. Do you need it? No. Is it a bargain? No. Are you saving money? No. I just think it's fun and this one wasn't disappointing. So that's my opinion on this one. The Cold Beauty Advent Calendar passes the test. I have a few more to do. I have one or two more. So I'll be filming those. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, hit that bell, like, comment for engagement. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.